Propane prices have risen sharply, creating a financial hardship for many customers in Arkansas. A number of factors that influence the price of propane have come together this winter to cause a dramatic rise in what customers pay for the gas. It's just almost a perfect storm to coincide with, uh, you know, a little bit of a short supply, a pretty big export market, a wet corn crop that needed a lot of propane to dry it, and then a, a cold, prolonged winter. And, and no, those four issues right there just combined to get us to where we are. David Hendricks owns Russell LP Gas, based in Arkadelphia and Delight, and services customers in five southwest Arkansas counties. He's been in the business for almost 40 years. Now, it's not so much an issue of, well, we're running out of propane, but it's an issue of we can't get the supply that we do have to the market that needs it. And that's what's causing spikes in price and uh, causing shortages that we see because it's extra cold. Uh, a lot of chicken farmers are burning way more gas than they have previously. They're burning so much that, you know, the dealers, by the time they make the round and get back around to them, they're running on empty again. One of those poultry farmers is Gene Farr of Lincoln in Washington County. He's having to heat five houses and has already spent around $20,000 on propane to protect his flock. My birds are about four weeks old and I'm probably going to have enough propane to last this flock. The concern I have is on the next flock. If I'm not going to go, I'm not going to put them down with propane above $253 a gallon. It just wouldn't make sense. And the most I've paid for propane this flock, I paid between $1.89 a gallon at the first up to the last I got, I think it was $249.9. Uh, I cannot survive. My houses are 14 years old and they use quite a bit of propane and I can't survive on say $2 a gallon propane. I, I won't be in business very long. The price increase is hitting residential, commercial and agricultural customers. Nursery owner Stanley Brown of Clarksville recently paid over $2 a gallon to fill a 1,000 gallon tank he uses to heat two greenhouses. The uh, sudden change this year has made it really uneconomical to even keep the greenhouses open. Uh, price doubled in a matter of 10 days from 219, my last fill up, to um, 445 will be the price that I would have paid last week and it may even go up higher than that. <clears throat> Due to the fact that I was running $100 a day propane bill, my bill would have doubled to $200 a day and that just priced me out of keeping my greenhouses heated to the level that I really need them. Some poultry integrators are working with their growers, offering to help pay a percentage of the higher cost of heating their houses. Retail dealers like Hendricks have no control over the wholesale price of propane that they obtain from their suppliers. But he expects that as temperatures return to more normal levels, propane prices will hopefully do the same.